That's me. I'm back with my friend Donita Forever. Hello. hello. And today we're going to tell y'all a story time that we've been meaning to do for a long time. But today we finally got time. You know, <laughs> <laughs> even though I can't even. This was for her little sister Barbara, which y'all probably seen her on her channel and stuff. But it was for her 18th birthday. Now, even though for your 18th birthday, you have to go out with a bang. Like, for your 18th birthday, you got to... It's everybody knows 18 and 21. 18 and 21, you gotta have epic nights, and we had the most epic night. It all started off. We pulled up like she was driving, and when we pulled up, the people asked us what's the room number and who was the name under, and that's when we already knew they was being strict that night. And we was probably gonna do oh, yeah, that was after we had got it. Yeah, okay, okay. Yeah, and then they got like this fat speaker, y'all, like this big old speaker. <laughs> so we was just bound to get put out either way to go. So, how, what our house like, was we was asking to get put out. Yeah, like, <laughs> <laughs> okay, so basically, we was drinking and stuff like that, even though you're not supposed to drink underage, so, don't drink underage. <laughs> <laughs> so, we had, you know, bottles, everybody was at the room drinking, doing whatever they do, smoking, turning up, dancing, like, we was just having a good time, but, like, it's like, some people was drinking dark and some people was drinking white, but I guess her sister, like, Barbara started drinking dark and white. And then y'all already know, like, Barbara, like, skinny, like, this skinny. So, like, when you skinny, you really can't hold your liquor. And then she just od like, she just went overboard. So, I don't even know how talk she... <laughs> you know, you, you didn't me. take no break. What you mean? <laughs> She's talking about you gonna talk. Yeah, that's what the story is. Everybody was getting drunk. It was turned. It was, the music was loud. The security already came banging on the door the first time. Mm -hmm. And then they left. So, I'm trying to tell them, like, you know, keep the music down. Stop... First of all, I hate when you go to a room and then people keep opening the door. Like, why do you leave the door open? Yes, and they're going to hear the music. The door. Like, close the door. Like, what is the door open for? Like, like either you're going to stay in or stay out. And if you leave, close the door behind you. But people were walking, leaving the door wide open. Mind you, they were smoking in the room. So when you leave the door open What's like it? this. I don't remember. Not in the room. They probably wasn't smoking I was about to say, I don't think they were. But we were smoking outside of the room. Like, everywhere. Mm -hmm. So it's like, okay, it's this loud-ass marijuana coming from all different places. Then you got loud music, and just it's just a mess. So y'all just got drawing attention to us. Like, it was just a mess. Right. Uh -huh. Everybody was dancing, twerking, turning up. I'm going to add the clips in. <laughs> <laughs> she does that <laughs> the security came knocking on the door da 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 they said be quiet da 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 so everybody like okay cool beans <laughs> they gonna be quiet but then they did not like they just didn't listen after that they came back to the door so i answered the door i tried to get us to stay like y'all y'all don't think y'all could give us another chance da da da, da. they like no the police are on their way <laughs> The police pulled up five cars deep. Like, it was never that serious. We were like, oh, they yeah. like, y'all gotta go right now. We like, like, that's serious. I forgot how many minutes they gave us. So then everybody like, we still got a couple minutes then. We about to turn up until we get put out. So yeah, they start turning back up and turn the music all the way up this time. Like, they was just the room. The police was pissed off. <laughs> they was like, look, y'all gotta go. So then we went to the parking lot. Everybody in there, mind you, we was, this room had two floors. So it was so many people in this room. So when we came outside, it was like just a big crowd of like teenage kids in the parking lot still dancing, still turning up, still screaming to the top of their lungs. And then the police just pulling up back to back, back to back, back to back. And I need to keep telling Barbara like, oh, oh, I got to pee and stuff like that. But Barbara just in the middle of the street like, ah! Like she was working she was everything done. in the middle of the street. I'm like, somebody put her in the car, please. I have to pee so bad, y'all. She was OC, like out of control, drunk, like. It was dope, holding her back, calming her down. Let's get to the most funny part of the story. So we in car on freeway driving, right? And Barbara in the front seat. It's me, Delilah, and my other friend Gabby in the back seat. <laughs> and Barbara upstairs, like she first she was real drunk. She like, oh my god, I gotta pay my mama back all this money. They took our deposit. She like, she gonna be so mad. And she was like, we had so much fun, sis. Like still drunk, <laughs> not even knowing. So then I don't know where she was like, I gotta throw up. So the whole time we were at home, she got her wet head out the window. So I'm thinking she's not going to throw up. Right, you know, she's just getting a little breathe. Right. <laughs> Mind you, we going like 80 miles per hour on the freeway. I don't know where she just started to roll it up something crazy. It was flying in the backseat. It was getting all over us. I was like, I was just screaming, trying to duck. Me and my friend Gabby was trying to duck behind us. This idiot. I friend Delilah just sitting there talking about, oh my God, y'all. Uh, it's the like, what's the uh, flight? No, she was like, uh, what is that? What shit flying back here? I was like laughing and the throat was getting all drunk. I didn't know her. She was just sitting there like, why is some wet shit flying? It's everywhere. She like, it's everywhere. Uh. And, and me and like 
got me hiding. We trying to duck underneath the seat and everything because it was so much though. Her car was through. Like her car was messed up. Like it was sick. Like it was. So we was taking my friend Gabby home first, and at this time, Danny that had to pee like. Bro, like out of control pee. Like I gotta pee right now for I pee on myself pee. Like I could not even walk, walk straight. Like <laughs> so we uh I had went in there with them though, cause I'm like I gotta get this throw up off of me. Like that's nasty. So I went in there with them to get the throw up off of me while she was peeing and stuff. Why me and Daddy to come back out to the car, right? This <laughs> idiot. Grass, like lay out in the grass and then Barbara lay out in the grass too but she's still sitting in the car like Barbara just still throw up so I, I come outside and then I see them outside the car I'm like what the hell is they doing it's time to go right. I get to the other side this bitch is laying on the floor peeing <laughs> like how are you peeing laying down how, are, how, are, how is that possible in the grass she told she had to pee in I walked up her pants down pants her down, booty was out. out everything <laughs> like what <laughs> I couldn't even take it serious. I'm running back to the car. I look, I was like, what the heck is you doing? <laughs> and then she was like, I think I'm in it. <laughs> she was like, I think I'm laying in it. I'm like, oh, what the fuck? It was everywhere. That shit was ridiculous. It was on her boot. <laughs> <laughs> it was on her boot. She had some hooks. <laughs> Everything. That shit was so I'm like, nasty. Oh, heck you know. Some people look like, bro, you gotta get up because you dead ass laying in the middle of your pee right now. <laughs> so we trying to help her up, but she just laughing. and she like, who house I'm spending that over? Cause I can't go home. I can't go home. I'm drunk as hell. My mama go kill me. me. So we like, okay, we just gonna take you home. Like, just be quiet, stay calm, just go house. Right, in my house. It was <laughs> like 25, 30 minutes just Barbara to get her still, in the house. Yeah, yes. outside my house. Right, Barbara still, still Barbara lay Barbara get out the car when we get to the house and Throw she just lay up. in the grass like, okay, Daniela, please. I'm like, oh Barbara my was God. crying. She was just rolling. She was like, I just want to go home. I'm like, oh my God, bro. Bro, we had to laugh. I said, I don't know if she peed again or what. Wait, let's stop saying her now. I just have to bleep it out every time. She was laying down, still peeing, I think. I don't know, but she was laughing or maybe she was crying. I don't even know at this point. Like, I just don't know. But it was a mess. I'm like, girl, it took us like literally dead 20 minutes to get this girl <laughs> to get her in the house. Like, we like, you have to go. Like, we got to get Barbara home and stuff like that. That was a crazy night. That was crazy. She was throwing up all night. Bro, that was crazy. Like, I ain't never threw up like that in my in my entire drinking career. My mama wasn't as mad as I thought. Oh, she was yeah. mad. She, she was so scared. Yeah, they was there. They was like, oh my god, my mama gonna be so mad and stuff because she had got the uh, room for us and stuff. She was like, she gonna be so mad when we get home. And then we get home. And she, your mama's like. Well, what was they drinking? I'm <laughs> like, she just so calm about the situation. Yeah, I guess that's the story. That was one wild night. Like, that night, that that night seemed like it. That oh, that night seemed like it was forever. <laughs> Yes, like and it, it seemed was like just, so long for that night to be over. <laughs> and it was just the part. It was just like the part where we had to leave the hotel. If we would have stayed at right. the room, everything would have been okay. Right. Because she would have just been at the room throwing up. Right. Maybe our it's friend wouldn't have been on herself. You know, like, it was two bathrooms. You know. <laughs> but it's just like we had to literally go all. And then the room was far. Wasn't Bro, it like so Southfield or something? It was like thirty something, thirty minutes. Bro, it was like, the yeah. whole time. I was like, what? Ah, was like, no, that's the end like, oh my god, what the fuck? This is so embarrassing. That nigga just left like, my car. My car. And then Gabby was like, oh my god, it's in your hair. And I was, was like, ah. I was going crazy. I was like, oh hell no, these bitches is fools. And then he was like, my car, my car. We got out the car. The throw up was literally covering the whole side of her car. It was inside the car. It was going everywhere. Barbara said, but I thought my head was out of the car. <laughs> it was everywhere, Like, it bro. definitely wasn't. Okay, I guess that's the story of her crazy 18th birthday. One throwing up, one peeing. <laughs> it was just a mess. It was just a mess. But alright, if you like the story time, then stay tuned for our other story times. If you like seeing Donita Forever on my channel, then stay tuned for that too. Um, like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications, and follow her. Her description is going to be... You said my description? Her information is going to be below in the description. Yeah, I was box. like, what? <laughs> you talk about her description is going to be? I'm like, do you want me to describe myself? Bye, <laughs> <laughs> <Hi>. y'all. <laughs> Tell me what you want.